They do seem to be going at it a little bit harder now, for sure. So this is Fox. He's the guy we got from Gypsy Wind Farms in South Carolina. Good looking fella, right? He's standing up on top of the bale of hay because he um, is tied off here so that we have room for Cody to go back here. So they'll fight in a small enclosed in container. Irene is currently getting Cody ready to go in here. We'll leave them together for like 24 hours. And then they come out as friends. That's what we're told. You guys will see. All right. Come on, Code. You gotta get up in there, hey buddy. Here we go. Oh. Oh. We're gonna release uh, the other lad, all right? Yeah. Okay. You don't want to wait for me? I mean, might be good to have this closed up properly. Uh, Fox's collar off? I I unclipped it. No, I mean his collar. There we go. All right, let's. This is non-violent. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't seem to be nearly as bad as we have been led to believe, but who knows? Fox might be like, get me, let me down. <laughs> I guess I can stop now, yeah. I get well, I mean, <laughs> film him a little while. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna. Cody's going straight for the, the sack. Yeah. Thank you. But the lads seem to be okay. So far. Neither of them have been around here. What's that? Talk louder, babe? Well, neither of these two rams have been around ewes for at least a week, probably longer. Uh, well, we definitely know Cody hasn't been since uh, March. My guess is the same for Fox. But we just got Fox a week ago. So we're introducing these two rams uh, for the first time. And to prevent any huge uh, injuries with potential rivalry and dominance fighting, We've been uh, reading and learning that you put them together real close so they can't really rear up and butt each other. So far, so good. Maybe they're just both very kind, gentle lads. They make noises. I really want Fox to get down. If you'll steer his head I can push him from behind and get him off of this. Um, eh, just, I mean, I'd say let him be, York. Won't it happen eventually? It's he he happen. can't stay up there all day. Okay, maybe it's just because I wanted to see some action, okay? Yeah, I, I'd say if we can avoid it. Hey, oh. Yeah, well, right. stepping around on my shoulder. <laughs> all right, we're all interested to in see what's going to actually happen here. But looks to be very anticlimactic. We hope it stays that way. <laughs> Oh, a little bit more about the trailer is that uh, a, a fella was also at the farm getting or exchanging one ram. There they are. They're wanting to wrestle a little bit, but they can't because he's on the hay. Dang it. But anyways, I felt bad for him. It's as odd as it seems. He had a big, beautiful, really nice trailer <laughs> that probably looked like it would hold five cattle or six or something. And he was like, man, I hate driving that thing around. Well, this is great. So we don't plan on really ever having any cattle. See, he needs to get down. He's going to hurt. Well, get up. There, there we go. Now you can wrestle. All right. Anyways, this is just seems like it's going to work out real nice having this small trailer. Because we could probably shove five of them in here, or six even, if we didn't have this. Because sheep, they like to huddle together anyways. So, 
this is big enough for us at least for the time being anyways tomorrow we'll let them out and if i catch them doing anything anything like wwe wrestling i'll try and film it <laughs> here comes the wrestling They can just push on each other a little bit left and right. Look at that. That's so cute. <laughs> so this is going to work out nice, I think. See, they can't even get any traction at all to push. Right, which is good. That's great. This is. Awesome. But they'll end up smelling like each other, basically. Yeah. At which point, you know... It's then they become friends. Hopefully, yeah. Cody will say, hey, you smell like me. <laughs> and Fox will go, hey, you smell like me. <laughs> Why are you sniffing? All right. Okay. One of them is going to pee. Ooh. And then he's going to pee. And he's going to be like, ah. I get it now. You know, you gotta go, you gotta go. I do. I really like Fox's sleek coat. Like that's and the color is really pretty. Cody's a little coarse. Yeah, Cody's a little stout, a more, little more stout looking. Fox gave him. Fox gave him a little kick. I'm and I like pretty. Cody's darker coat. I I like the sandy, like Fox's sandy coat. Well, we like them both. We like them both. We're happy we have. Two handsome brands. Even though Irene is scared of Cody because he likes to kind of butt you a little bit. It's interesting. Cody really, I think because he's so friendly, he wants to play and butt me. And it just makes me nervous. Whereas Fox really, he's trying to get away from me. Like he'll come for treats, but he does not want to be on a leash or near me. Cody wants to be near me. <laughs> That's all they can do. That's so funny. That's good. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> I mean, that's like the biggest thing you can have. That's it. They, man, they, they slip around a little bit, and that's it. They're all they're pushing on each other. That's really all they can do. It's so funny. <laughs> Fox is eating while he's backing up. <laughs> it's so cute. All they can do is push each other. Anyways. They do seem to be going at it a little bit harder now, for sure. We need to just walk away. Just yeah. Yeah, if we had just put them in and together, they'd be running back and charging at each other and rearing up and wow. Yeah. And I mean, that'll still like happen after, you know, yeah. we'll still do that, but it, it's not going to be constant and as deadly as. Let's hope not. That's what I'm reading. Okay, we just let him out. Just let him out. Seconds ago. And they seem to be perfectly fine. You know. Cody's more interested in probably butting us. 
There's Fox. There's Cody wanting to butt me. Backing up a little bit. He's kind of an a-hole. But he never really, he just wants to intimidate me somehow. Whenever he does that, I'm lucky because I'm who I am. I, I straight up punch him right in the nose. Well, it's happened a bunch. I'm going to keep doing it. And that's what I do. I'm an idiot. So that's Fox, and we like him so far. Anyway, so that seemed to have worked. He wants to... He wants me to pet him. And, and he wants to bite you, so... I would say let's, uh, let's let them be, and how about you get on the four-wheeler, and we close the gate, and then we can record. Okay, anyways, so that's what's up. Oh, and he's eating. He's fine, quit being so weird. Alright, so that worked so far. Ta-da!